ba, 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 ba. Right, okay then. Bish bash bosh. What is the time? It's uh, quarter two. Note that in the log. Which is another way of saying the notepad that I have next to me that's supposed to keep track of where all the funny moments are. So I can properly find them in the footage after the fact. You okay, sweet pea? You okay, sweet pea? Yes. Who's a good dog? Who's my good dog? Who's my... What do you want? What do you want? Huh? What do you want? Huh? You want to go on my lap? Is that what you want? You want to sit on my lap? Is that what you want? You're supposed to be the eye candy. You're supposed to sit there for the audience and be the eye candy, huh? Yeah. Yes, you are. Who's a good girl? Who's my good girl? Yeah, who's my good girl? Yeah, you get your tickle spot. Where's your tickle spot? Is that it there? That's it there. That's it there. <laughs> Can I make a leg kick? No? <laughs> who's a good girl? I know you are. I know you're a good girl. Where's your, where's your tutor? Huh? What's your tutor? Oh, what's this? Ah! Want, you just want cuddles. Oh, yes, you want to go up on my lap. Okay, accept my lap. Ah, right, okay, we'll just go over to the back of the PC. Ah, dog wants cuddles, so dog gets cuddles. Hello, darling. Yes, I love you too. Who's a good dog? Yes, you are. Um, right, um, so good evening, everybody. Good evening, and uh, hi there. Um, please bear with me a moment. I'm just, uh, I'm just getting sorted. I'm getting licked as well. Uh, I'm just getting sorted in uh, the Hold Fast Nations at War uh, Thursday evening uh, line battle, uh, which happens at 9 o'clock. So I've got about another 13 minutes. I just wanted to get into the server fairly quickly because spots do tend to fill up uh, quite fast. If you have Hold Fast Nations at War, the server is called EU number 8 uh, Public Line Battle. It's just one of the empty servers that uh, this particular clan has decided to hijack and uh, invited, well, which, wh whomever wishes to partake. Uh, normally taking the form of other clans, uh, ZF among them. So, you know, there's lots of different groups. Um, so, yes, I hope you're... Oh, thank you, Casualist. Thank you very much. And uh, Calendor. Thank you. Thank you, both of you. That's very kind. Thank you, guys. Um, so, um, yeah, to bring you up to speed on what's going on, uh, this week it's the fourth week of work on the latest YouTube video, uh, which is part of a video essay series that I'm working on. Um, I have been working on it for a couple of years now, sort of on and off, uh, on the side and uh, it's part 10 of 10 um, of that series and um, yeah progress is fine progress is good um, I'm, I was able to stay uh, quite um, attentive and uh, was quite efficient in the editing today so I managed to get a whole load of oh hang on see message he could be telling me to switch sides uh... now, hang on it's Chinny wanting to join the team speak but he can't okay hang on Right. Um, hang on, I'll just get into the game. Because there's nothing on the sofa. Hang on. Right. Okay. Cool. Can, oh wait, you can't see this. Why can't you see it? I guess it's not added on OBS. Hang on just a second. There it is. Yeah, for some reason it, it wasn't clicked on OBS. Can you see it now? Yeah, you can see it now. Um, right. Um, so yes, uh, sorry, what was I saying? So I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just working on... Um, just working on this side project of mine and fingers crossed I hope you like it uh, we'll have to see uh, but um, yeah so I'm just kind of plugging away as best I can um, so for the next uh, well in 10 minutes time the games will begin and then for this I'll, I'll be doing this for one hour um, after that I don't know might do something else or might just uh, go back and get on with work uh, before bed uh, I've got lots of work to do um, we shall we shall see. Um, but yes, I hope you're all having a lovely week wherever you are in the world. Um, I'm also here on the TeamSpeak channel with um, ZF Swat Knight uh, and also Dinklebean and Kenneth, Kenneth, who are the two gentlemen uh, that were in the whole fast bullshittery, that, that very brief one that I made. Um, so Kenneth is the guy screaming, I'm walking here from Boston, and Dinklebean is the very posh British man who's, uh, what was he saying, why are there so many uh, gentlemen from the colonies? Um, you'll see them more in future whole fast bullshitteries. I'm sure of it. Oh god, I've been discovered. Thank you, end back Joey. Thank you, end back. Thank you very much. That's very kind. What? 
Fuck off! Right. Um, but yes, uh, oh, thank you, uh, J15T98J. Thank you very much. That's very kind. Much appreciated. Um, so yeah, uh, so what else is happening, really? Not much, not much this week, truth be told. Um, just kind of work, work's been fine. Uh, editing's been fine, so, you know, just editing away. Um, yeah, just streaming some RimWorld, and we did some VR on Wednesday. We did some Pavlov, that was great fun. Oh, thank you, Dormin. Thank you very much, Dormin. Much appreciated. Um, yeah, all's, all's good, I guess. All's good indeed. Um, but, uh, yes, if you have, if you have Holdfast, feel free to, uh, jump right in with us. There seems to be a line going that way. They're on maneuvers. Right, I'm just gonna say hi to the guys in the team speak with me. Hi guys! Hello! Thanks Guten for responding Tag. to my message, you cunt. Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah. Hello. No. I think Tyler I got the TeamSpeak muted. Bear with me. How strange. A fucking idiot. Uh, you say that as a, if that wasn't something new. I shall restart TeamSpeak. No. Thank you, Bread404. Thank you very much, Bread. <clears throat> Most kind. Hang on a second. Hello. Your cunt. Hello. Hello. <laughs> did he? Did he actually break his team speak? <laughs> I'm not surprised. That's strange. I can't seem to hear, hear them in TeamSpeak. I'm just looking at the settings. Have I muted Meanwhile, something? I'm listening to patriotic oh. British right music, headset. even though we're going to be playing... Thank you, Alex. Thank you very much, Alex. We're forming the big line, gents. The big line. Oh, uh, Dinkle, I'd just like to state that you're such a pussy for not playing Erica. Yeah, Fuck I can't you. hear them either. I'm just Wait, trying no, to figure, wasn't you. figure out why. It wasn't you. Never mind. I'm sorry. You just abused me. I'm sorry. No, I'm oh, sorry. Forgive me. What are you talking about, Jenny? Uh, fucking social had Erica, mm. you know the German marching song. That's yeah, it my setting. Uh, requested it's all fine. on totally the stream. Yeah, and he did play it. Why? Because it's like, oh, it's you too can offensive. Hear them. No, you can't. can't. Do it. You can't it's hear them being able That song is over a hundred years old. That, oh no! That thing isn't even related to anything. I'm I'm playing actual SS songs on my stream, and he doesn't want to play an old German say, song. But it's scary when you do that because you're German and you playing Hearts of Iron as Nazi Germany is quite scary. I was to playing watch. the Frankreich, literally written in 1940 for the invasion of France. That was beautiful. While I was invading France, I can't explain this. All of my settings so, are fine. I should be able to hear them just a okay. Swap that was there. Yeah. No, it's perfectly fine. What if... Turn that off and on again. Way worth, basically. <laughs> everything that... Get away with it. Every, yes, everything <laughs> everything that isn't an, anti-constitutional, like borderline, me. as long as we don't mention the Führer, we're fine. Uh, Dinkle, we've got a slight problem. don't say the words, you can allude to it, but just don't say the words. Yeah, right? things like Sieg Heil yeah. Victoria is probably off the list. Yeah. I can hear them talking up, about Jenny? the SS. Uh, we've got a slight problem. No, you can't. What's that? Server's full. Um, oh my god, you can! How is that even possible? The, band someone. the desktop <laughs> audio values are, are no spiking, reason. and yet I can't hear it. There you go. Thank, Thank you. Just, just tell me, just tell me joke. I'm not actually gonna, gonna do How that. How can you hear Tell me when, tell me when, tell me when. It says desktop <laughs> audio playing, but I can't hear the Jesus. desktop audio. That makes no sense. So it realizes he's muted on Team Sick, right? Let me try restarting. Restarting all of TeamSpeak again. Assignment admin mode. Run as administrator. Wrong audio output selected. What do you reckon? Oh, it's the right one. Because he was hearing us the whole time, but he wasn't able Whoops. to hear. Hello? No, I, I don't ah, think he can hear us. Hello? Can you hear us? Back. He can't Wombo? hear us. I don't know if Wombo. you can hear me, guys, but I can't hear you, and I don't know why. What the fuck? <laughs> he heard my burp, though, and I'm at least No, the chat, the chat can Very hear strange. you. Very strange. Very strange. He can't hear us. 
That's oh. the thing. So we can talk to okay. his chat right now and he can't hear us. So uh, where's my I'll copy of Mein Kampf? I'll just the, in, uh, the in-game voice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are you allowed a copy of Mein Kampf? Yes. You can have a copy. No problem. Okay. Can you read it in public? I can, can, can you read uh, it? No, can actually I can't. <laughs> <laughs> no, last time I checked, all Thank Germans you, Dr. Seago. Thank you very much, Doctor. Build cars. Hello, can anyone hear me? Oh, and really nice roads. Oh, boy. Can anyone hear my microphone? <sighs> Sorry. Oh, well, yeah. this, uh, this is, this is be fun. Can you guys hear my mic? Is my mic on? <laughs> Lovely. Okay. Yeah, I'm still disappointed that the songs for the Prussians are not uh, historically accurate for the era we're fighting in. I cannot hear your mic. Yeah, but Paris, you give a shit about historical accuracy. I, I do. I, I, why do you, why do you, you think I now? hate Battlefield 5? Because <laughs> it's shit? Yeah, that's true How as well. strange. And I don't have time to change that's it. That's probably the main reason why you hate it though, isn't it? Fuck, because the service yeah, full I by always, now. Yeah, I, I always wanted to fulfill my dream of anything. fighting as a disabled Damn, woman no in the British Paratrooper Battalion. Shit, it's just like just me and you chat this evening. Because that's and, and, exactly well, what you can the at least hear them. Needs. Well, yeah, they're already retarded disabled enough. Women. They don't need women. Fuck. <laughs> Got him. Do I have my mic muted? No, no, no. It's KJ. them. They're, their lights are flashing, but I can't hear them. Yeah, it's shitty. Are you still yeah. dying? Yes. Sure, I'll re in the microphone. Good. Excellent. I might, I might, I might say uh, get well soon if you free a spot up for me. Is that what it takes for you to want me to get better? Oh, fuck. Abuse? oh for fuck's sake! Somebody, there was literally just hey, a spot I looked down. On yeah, someone just. And it was gone. <laughs> Let me see your shoes real quick. Take your shoes yes, off. Yes, admin abuse. That's, that's what I need. Let me see it. Let me see your shoes. So is Soviet we'll just going to play his Open game? Down, not down. hearing us today, by the sounds of it. Oh, we're live. Oh, we're not live yet, silly. Sued. Well, well, we're going. Right. We're going for it. Yeah, good well, luck, guys. Can you hear them now? Oh, that's Thank a you. good point. Is his, is his VR stuff plugged in? If he has it set to change, then it might. Have... Wait, France versus Britain? I'm disappointed. What are we? So we'll be the French. Ugh. How okay. Ah, uh, fair enough. Okay. I missed it. Where's Dinkle? I don't think I've got anyone with me today. My head says properly broken. It sounds really distant, like un almost underwater. Okay. Thank you, Chase Rella. Thank you. Bon, je veux que les hauts classés qui sont première classe défendent les ordres. Ok. C'est noté. Ah, je vais derrière, qui devant. Euh, pas derrière. Ce sera plus simple. Ok. On a, on a un gars de la vieille garde avec nous Je sais pas. C'est le serveur major. Ok. Où est Tinkle Et il y a monsieur Franck aussi. Il est là. Donc les deux de la vieille garde, vous répétez les ordres. Have we got everyone There he is. Ok, there we go. Right, anyway. Um, sorry, I'm, I've been thrown off a bit by this audio problem. Um, so this is round one. Uh, round one of five of Holdfast, the Thursday, uh, yeah, the Thursday evening games at nine o'clock. And uh, there are two sides, the French and the British. And effectively, uh, our role is to survive, really. One musket bullet will kill you, flat out. Um, well, uh, you can survive them. They're too loud, are they? Okay, I'll turn them down. Hang on. Step out the line. Okay. Is my VR plugged in? It might... I, I don't know. I, I'm not sure what the problem is. I think my headset might be dying. Right. Okay. Right, so sorry, where was I? Uh, so effectively, our role is to follow the officer's orders. Oh, they buggered off. And to fire in volleys towards the British. 
Uh, merci beaucoup. I think that's what they say. Right face. Right face. More shoes. With me, uh, let's okay. go. Okay, Stinko. I have no idea if there are British uh, pig dogs. Oh, it's the weird. The audience doing this see. sort of. I think. Yeah, my headset. I think my headset's just broken. Uh, put it down. Uh, too sweet. Okay. Alright, more shoes. Hold here, hold, I'm going to have a little peek through my spyglass. Oh, there they are. On my left, take aim towards that smoke cloud, bottom of the reticle, half yeah. web that dead tree behind them. Half web the tree, and fire. Okay, reloading. Oh, nice shots, monsieur. The cowardly pig dogs have eaten their heads behind the hill. Do not right, so uh, so far the British have two kills. Aim, we only have one, uh, well, the we don't have any. Take aim. Okay. Quickly, 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 quickly! Half one to three behind him, and fire! Oh, wow, we were so close. We got a couple of hits. I saw the blood. <laughs> Look at the dirty pig dog blood in the snow. Oui. Vive la France! Alright, uh, Monsieur, take him. Same again. Maybe three quarters up the tree behind him. Fire! Okay. Oh, okay. did one get one? This guy is Dinklebean, I believe he is streaming. Feel free to tune into him if you like. You're a quiet bunch this evening. Um, are you all alright? I don't even know if you can hear me. I can hear you. You can hear me? No my, my headset's you're... fucked. Yeah. Uh, have you left your VR headset in, Swat Knight says? I don't know, I don't know. Thank you, Count oh, okay. Boob. Thank you very much. Right, I can hear him as well. Uh, you're just all being very quiet this evening, so I didn't know if something I mean, was wrong. As long as Dinkle's not speaking, you can hear everyone. Yeah, yeah, I suppose you're Thank right. you, Camp yeah, Boob. Thank I am you. the loud one. Um, okay, what? um, ooh, the ends are open. Take aim towards the southwest. Bottom of the red girl, halfway up the trees. Fine, pick one off. Fire. Oh, I hit one. Holy shit. Ooh, ooh, I hit one. Close. Did you? Good lad. Yeah. Well <laughs> right. Vive la France. Vive la France. Vive la, Vive la France! Vive la France! That's right! Right face! With me, monsieur! Excusez-moi, Kenneth Lee! <laughs> that guy, uh, that was Excusez Kenneth from Boston? Excusez-moi, s'il vous plaît, move your house out of the way! <laughs> that is what my mother used to say to me as a wee boy. Oh, oh shit, they're behind that rock, sir! Oh, no Thank you, Basu! Thank you very much, Basu! But why I was trained in the finest military school Napoleon has to offer. <laughs> I was the man himself who chopped off King Louis' head. <laughs> How was it, sir? Achievements... Sorry? How was it, sir? How'd it go? Oh, I had an erection the whole time. Right, okay. Too much information. Whatever the... French, there's no such thing. <laughs> Oh, right, is that a be prepared up here because they are look oh no that is an admin. Okay. Never mind. Be careful though, be vigilant, keep your head on a swivel. There could be British pig dogs anywhere. Because okay, so the right, British have eight kills, kills, the French have six. All, uh, no. That's still what fairly even Stevens the, uh, for the minute. Poor uh, Frenchman officer. So it's, oh, oh, oh! Oh, 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 oh my god! Lineup on my right! On my right! Oh left! Left, copy, left, copy, left, copy. left, 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 On their heads! On their heads, bottom of the reticle! Take aim! Quickly! While the hands are open! Fire at will! Oh, it's him! Go on! Cut him down! Thank you, Zero Go Rules! On. Thank no, you very much! No! It's him! No! Oh, we were close. Thank you, Zyphon! That's a warning shot! Alright, gents! Right face! Walk with me while you reload! They are trying to flank me, the flunkers! We're going to flunk the flunkers! Right, on my right! Take aim! On my right! On my right! That is my left! On my right! Merci beaucoup! Bottom of the echo, just above their head, sort of halfway up that tree that they're standing next to. Halfway up the tree, fire! Ah, oh, crap. Oh, this was so close. We must have gotten a couple of eats there. Nothing. Ezio, can you not do that? I thought we got a kill just then. You got my hopes up. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dinkle. Take aim! Where are they? Oh, the bastards. Hold on. Oh, oh they wow. Take aim towards the cannon. Bottom of the echo is going to be about uh, the, uh, three quarters of the way up the tree behind them. The game, adjust! Aim for that flag! Fire! Oh, you cannot believe how close those shots were was used! Oh! There was about a monstrous difference! Oh, yeah. mon dieu! Ah, oh, look at that big smoke cloud! Take aim towards the smoke cloud, mon About halfway up the tree behind him! 
And fire. Fire it. Oh, you kind of, you that frustration. Oh my god. I'm going a little bit German, Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, SWAT knight. Um, right, yeah. Halfway up the tree behind him again. Take aim. Aim for that big smoke cloud. Fire. Oh, come Dang. on, I'm begging you. Just get one of them. Oh, mon dieu. Right, where are our friendies? Okay, we've got 11 to 12 party. kills now. So they are flanking them. We've got a good flank on, gentlemen. The French are doing well. Bottom of the reticle. Let's try uh, about the top of the, just above the top of their smoke. And fire. Oh, I actually got a hit. Good, we're in good firing in good volleys here. Even though individually we're not hitting anything. Right, we'll use the game. What all, all one person has to do is get lucky and get a kill. Bottom of your reticle, half waves at three. And fire. Is that big or someone needs them? No that kills. Big dogs hiding behind that bush. A uh, hill, I mean. Oh. Oh. Okay, so in three minutes there's a default bayonet charge. Again. Here they come over the hill. Fire! Oh, what? Oh, oh my god! 153 meters! <laughs> Thank you, Stump. Thank you. Right. 153 meters! Do we have a flag there? Oh, fuck. No. Well, he's just gonna have to decompose. <laughs> well, shit. Okay, so that's me out. Uh, so, uh, the reality of uh, musket warfare. Thank you, um, Nor Ninja. Thank you, Nor Ninja. And Stump. Thank you, Stump. Right, okay, so the French line there has now moved forward. The, we've got 32 yeah, kills gonna, versus the British. Is, the British is 18. We're doing very Bend well. Little, Let's go. So Dinkle's line is here. There's another French line over there. I think the British just... Uh, the, yeah, oh, wow. A French line has been very brave. They've advanced all the way up to their camp. Oh, and have been slaughtered for it. So they're pulling out. It's the KRA themselves. It's that clan who are hosting... Whoa. Oh, they got punished for that shit. British Redcoats just ran, yeah, cut them down. Afraid not, so my audio is going to be a bit weird. Apologies if, if it's too loud or too quiet or I talk over it, anybody. Oh, the sound of my voice, let's form to either my this is Hay Bales. Either my shoulders, let's to the sound of my One voice. of the most experienced officers in the Facing Redcoats. Between the door. So another small British line. Oh, they are getting enveloped. The British camp is getting enveloped. But all the same, there are now fewer Redcoats. Is it just these two lines? Is that it? Is that all the British have? I think that might be the case. This is all they have. Okay, so if it gets to the bayonet charge in 1 minute and 34 seconds, uh, it, we will have a decisive advantage in numbers. Oh, they're doing very well. They're firing in volleys, moving forward just over the hill, keeping most of their bodies concealed. They have 26 kills versus our 36. Right, lads, two sets forward. Now, present arms, rest the Thank you, Mini. Thank you very much. circle on top of the enemy's head. Fire. So right now the British are wielding what's called the brown bess, or rather it was, it was dubbed the brown bess. It's a type of smooth bore musket, so no rifling on the thing. Uh, it's muzzle loaded, so you have to sort of stick the uh, the shot and the powder and the uh, was it, the, the paper, the, the wadding paper, down the end of the barrel every time. Um, oh. Oh god, okay, they're trying to reform. Come on, Mike. It fires a 19.3 uh, millimeter musket, which is a musket ball, which is, is absolutely massive. Whoa. Considering, considering that a modern round is what, 5.56 millimeter? These are 19 millimeter. So an injury from one of these musket balls is incredible. It's gre grievous injuries. Your chance of surviving a musket ball hit. Yeah, modern medicine, uh, you know, uh, medicine at the time notwithstanding, your chance of survival was extremely slim. Like, if it hit you in the chest, you were doomed for infection. If it hit you in the limb, then it would probably destroy the limb. Or at least necessitate its amputation, which was the most common operation performed at this time period in around the 18th century. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you very much, Doctor. Okay, the British are being surrounded and cut down by musket shot. Okay, now is the mandatory charge. So no more shooting, it's just bayonets. Only the officers with their pistols can shoot. Everyone else, it's swords and bayonets. Both sides at this time would be using the socket bayonet, which kind of clicks underneath the barrel, or at least the British Redcoats do. The French, for some reason, I think purely to be, to be different, put theirs on top of the barrel, which makes no sense because you just block your ability to aim. Not that you would aim with a musket, but all the same. It's a bit asinine. Yep, we've got a decisive advantage in numbers. And Dinkle made it, it seems. 65 kills to the French, 35 to the British. Viva la France! Round one of five, everybody. Round one of five belongs to the French. Fantabulous. 
I'm impressed that you can keep up the accent can't for so long. <laughs> it is Dude. hard. <laughs> I like how you went there. Oh, oh no, that became, that became German. I'm sorry, Swap I was like, yeah, you just. <laughs> whatever. I can hear it's like, it's very faint. I reckon my headset's busted. Um, they're in the distance. Ooh. Okay, pressure. Ooh, are you hearing that? Oh. You hearing that sound? It's like the, the wind sounds like. It's got like artifacts all over it. Yeah, yeah, there's GDU. GDU? Alright, I think I need to buy a new headset. If you're with me, over here to the east, we're There's going over dingle. here. Go with me. Get to form up over here. So, gentlemen, I would it's like to right, line fuck, then. I'll just buy a new in front one. of me. That's it. There we go. On the double. There we go. I'm so sorry, I can't carry up the French now, and I can't <laughs> do German SWAT. I'm not even going to try. Um, I end wire. up sounding very, very camp. Um, and we wouldn't want that. So loose hey? cable? Quick double R C G R though, we fucking executed that three times first for that now. Let's plug into how long do I have? Good, good, keep it keep it up. Um Support me! Long live Help me. I've got a lot to work with here. Shit. Um but I'm trying. Never mind, I'll have to fix it after the stream. Sorry everybody. Okay, um, right, so it's no, round two now. Try German, then, but this I, time I, with I, the no, Prussians, no, no, so I'm the Germans, myself. effectively. Look like a right tit. Hmm. We've got a surge in this round though, that's good. Excellent. We're live at 30 30. Let's go, guys. With me. Here we go. Right, so we're now live again. We're going to be the right flank covering that aqueduct. <clears throat> thank you, Emilius. Thank you very much, Emilius. Okay, so as the, yo, as the Prussians, we're using a similar type of rifle, sli slightly smaller in musket ball size compared to the uh, brown bears of the British. Uh, so, whereas they have 19.3 millimeters, I believe we have 18.5 millimeter, if my memory serves me correctly. Thank you, Ted Ginger. Ted Ginger? Thank you, Ted Ginger. And Charles. Thank you, Charles. Um, all the same, each, indiv each individual musket ball would be travelling at around 300 metres per second, which is nothing compared to modern weapons whose bullets fire at about, well, rifle bullets travel at about 800 metres per second. So it's a slow moving, very large shot. Thank you, Brad. And fire! Those were very close, gents. We could have got one or two there. Very close indeed. Right face. This is the big line. Right face. Walk with me while you reload and then pick up the pace. Once you're reloaded. Okay. Oh, force out the line. We need to move to the back. Okay. So no kills for either side right now. Okay. Oh, British shots are incoming. Whoa, Christ. Bloody hell. Yeah, they're firing on top of the hill. Uh, Sana doesn't like this game. Uh, right. That sucks. Hmm. Right. Why not? I don't know. Not his mum. You ask him. Yes. Yes, yes. How? Yes. You know yes. him. What we've got, lads, is a big British line. Yes. Yes, yes. 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 Yes, yes. 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 Mm, yes. Right. They're waiting for us. Um, any ideas? Retreat? Good. No. R retreat? Yeah, retreat. We're not I like retreat. We're the most oh, well. disciplined hey, army on this earth. Yes. We're going to go for I it. I like retreat. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Lovey and Selly Pelly. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Can we retreat in the direction of the enemy? Retreating is your good. Thank you, Jill. Lil Jerk. Thank you, Lil Jerk. What did you say about retreating, Ningle? About face. Turn around. We're going this way. Stop this. About face. All right. We're not. We're not retreating. We're advancing in the other direction. Isn't that what everybody says? Oh, there's the British and they're in the open. Bollocks. <laughs> okay, uh, gents. Form double rank you, on faces. my right. Thank you. Double rank on my right. Aim towards those Brits running away. Bottom of your reticle is going to be in the same sort of area before. Top of that tree. Bottom of the reticle. Top of that tree. And then align it ever so slightly to the left so you can hear it, see the Brits. And fire. No hits. At least no kills. Sorry, you heard the man, back rank. Oh no, there we go. 
Where they gone? Okay, five kills in total for the About Prussians. two trees up, two trees in height. Take aim towards those Brits to the north. Two trees in height. And fire. Ooh, you hit I'm one amazed if you get a kill. That was very close, though. I saw, because I've got the big spyglass, because I'm important. I don't believe you, actually. Okay. You're not important at all. <laughs> hey, I hey, get off! Get the fuck off! <laughs> get the fuck off! Got an admin on me! Get it off me! Get it off! <laughs> Fucking hell. Admin, stop distracting my line! <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? Well, what can someone mean by no? <laughs> I mean, no. Do you not know what no means? So yes, uh, the gentleman uh, who is our officer him? is uh, Dinklebean. He is streaming, I, I believe. Um, feel free to I'm have speechless. a look at the whole fast oh. Twitch bit and you'll probably see him. Kenneth might also be streaming. Uh, yeah, KJ, Kenneth, no the guy from Boston. No. Right, okay, on my right. British are right there. Bottom of the reticle. Uh, yeah, about a tree's height. Imagine a big tree in front of them. Uh, that's very imaginative, isn't it? Imagine a tree and then go up that tree's height. Bottom of the reticle about there and fire. Oh, those were good trees you were imagining. Those shots were on target. We must have gotten a couple of hits there. I saw blood. Cool. We're always Keep very close, there. but never Thank you, Kater. Kater? Thank you, Kater. Let's go. Okay. Right. Let's go. So we have nine kills versus the British's three. Um, oh, we're getting quite close now. A good volley from the British will probably hit us. They'll be able to fire at near point blank range. Uh, at the time, point blank doesn't mean, uh, well, it didn't mean what it does today. It doesn't mean placing your gun right up against somebody. Point blank just means uh, you don't have to adjust your aim upwards in order to hit your target. You just point in a straight line with your musket and you will hit. Effectively. So point blank for a musket is about 50 meters. To the top of their smoke region. They're directly in front of us to the northeast. Advance slowly until you can see them. Imagine there's a big puff of smoke above their heads. What we radical at that smoke? Oh, they've just run behind that hill. They saw you all coming. Yeah, stay in right. line. Stay in line, stay in line. Stay in line. To, right, to the right, to the right, traverse him to the right a little bit. There they are. What we oh radical God. at their heads to the top of their smoke region. Fire! Yeah. Come back down the hill! Come back down the hill! Yeah. Reload! At the bottom of the hill. Oh, gas load, you poor soul. Christ, Dinkle. Christ. Hey? Line was about this yeah. speak, and you fixed it a bit. Oh, oh fuck four it. guys Off died. Down. 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 Dinkle's Off dead. Down. Panic, panic. <laughs> every man for himself. Run. It's every man for himself. Run. Fuck. Run. What are we going to do? Run. What are we going to do? At the Who's enemy. on second? Who's on don't second? Be, don't worry, I'll be your human shield man. I'll stream too. Should we charge? Okay, no, bomb no five charge. lines and uh, just stay there, alright? Right. Okay. <laughs> I'm just, uh, <laughs> just getting panicked for the fun of it. Uh, is that for sure? Uh, so Thank you, Thuzzle. Thank you very much, Thuzzle. Line up there. Much appreciated. Okay, everyone, yeah, let's form go a single line on the right of the toilet brush. On the right of the toilet brush. Ah, she needs a semen control. Aye, aye. He's pretending to be me. Okay, aim at the Brits on the top of the hill to our north. Christ. Ready? Hey! Yeah. Fire, fire, fire! Hey! I killed... Who did I kill? Best organizing ever. Wrecked Ventress, I think. Hey, hey, hey. I don't do this stuff, alright? Yes, fantastic. Okay. Okay, okay. Kill from 84 down, meters. We have to live with it. Just on the edge of the effectiveness range. I'm not an NCO, I'm just a guy with a toilet for that thing. Where did Soji go? I think yeah. he died. I, I mean, on your feet, coward! On your feet! Hey, buddy, you're gonna stand up or I'm gonna murder you. Thank you. Okay, things are retreating. Okay, we have 27 kills to the British's 19. Oh, look, the Prussians are doing a big outflank there. Okay. Right, here we go. So, for those just joining the stream, this is round two of the five round uh, whole fast nations at war regular thursday game hosted by the kra clan uh, we're just guests here you see uh, digby told me about this and invited me and i jumped in good digby enjoys this as do i thank you one point thank you two one and fire 
Okay. Yeah. Whoops, that's my gun. Fuck. Here we go. Yeah, Soviet clone. Oh! Oh, okay, God! Oh, Doc! Oh, fire at will. Fire at will. <laughs> Thank you, Doc. <laughs> Christ! Where for big and big fireballs? Oh, I think we're here. No, I think he's offline on Steam. Thank you, Doc. Fire at Willy said. Okay. Reload, 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 reload. Oh, they are. They're pretty right behind us. They're right behind us. Oh, God. We're going to die. You know what? Who's up for a good charge on the British flag? Charge. Aye, aye. Charge. Okay. For the Koenig! Oh, for the Koenig! Death to the British! Fuck you! Fuck fish and chips! Fuck the British! Don't shoot on the charge, don't shoot on the charge. Stand! No, 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 you can't shoot on the charge, that's the rule. Well, yeah, until we get further orders, basically. I mean, you can always run and join the friendly line, but. Hey, don't shoot on the charge! You're breaking the rules! You can just fire a gun, buddy. Don't do that anymore. Yeah, they're breaking the rules. Like, if you, if you can just run and gun on the charge, that's not how it was done. I mean, granted, we didn't necessarily chase them halfway across the map, but you know. We're trying to replicate line battle warfare, not cheese it, you know? <laughs> oh god, they're splitting up! Oh shit! I shoot! I shoot! Stand here and, and die, die like a red coat! Oh god, he's loaded his pistol. Alright, bitches. 1v1, 1v1, 1v1. 1v1, 1v1, alright, 1v1, 1v1. He one said, one he said 1v7, yeah? 1v7? That's what you heard? Oh yeah, 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 good, good. Yeah, alright, good, good. Soviet, I got a question, man. Thank you, Daniel. Thank you very much. Thank Why you. Why are you and the, two, and the toilet brush carrying the name? The same name. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I just shot at him. Uh, they're right. from behind. Is there more of them? I'm reloading. Any officers? Any officers? So, uh, no officers. So, uh, what, how about a minute of silence for the Inkobin? Yeah, thank you. Guess we. Hey, Boys victory! Well done! Round two! Hey! Fantastic! Oh, this, this audio problem is horrible. I can barely hear any, like, distant voices. Okay. Yeah, I can, I can barely hear them pickled. Sorry. Right. Oh. Okay, so 2-0 to us. This is round three. I lied. Frankie's alive and he streamed with Sadder. No, he's not. <laughs> Frankie's dead. He died of autoerotic asphyxiation. Where's Dinkle? No, to the north. This is him. Where's Dinkle? This must be him. In front of me. Yeah, here he is. We're gonna go here. You're just like everyone in school. Just all mean to me. <laughs> okay. oh. Double rank it. Don't make me feel bad. I'm supposed to be mad at you. Go check the Sandy YouTube channel. No, no, Frankie's dead. Seriously. Frankie died of autoerotic auto asphyxiation. He told me three days ago. Again. Dear oh dear. Are we live at 30? Hi there, Sumo Bear. Welcome indeed. Yes, just as Thank you, Ridgeback. Thank you, Ridgeback. I didn't look at the announcement because I'm too. Right, let's go. Okay, so this is round three, beginning now. Oh, he may not be line. the brightest, but he's all you have. Inspiring. 
Um, it's worth noting that most games aren't like this. We're intentionally sort of trying to bring the line combat element uh, with a bit of role play, you know, to, to try and make it feel authentic. Um, yeah, most games people sort of hide behind trees and shit. It's a bit rubbish. Thank you, Beezies. Thank you very much. Let's go. Over here. Hello there. Colonel Dinklebean. Hello there. Hello there. You're supposed to say General Kenobi. Well, but you're not General Kenobi. Colonel Dinkle. No. You're not a fucking General Dinkle. I'm not gonna call you General. <laughs> you're supposed to say General Kenobi. Fucking. Where are the British? Someone's made contact. Oh, okay, some musket balls are landing around us. Hang on. Where are they firing from? Must be quite high arc there. Is that them down there? Yep, we see the British. Okay, we scored one kill, they have none. Who said that? Who's that? Gas boat. Promotion. Give yeah. this man a Victoria Cross. No, we don't have. That's an English thing. An Iron Cross. I don't think oh. we have them yet. Uh, left face. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Left face? What? Oh. <laughs> Confused the rear end there. You're not the officer here. Right. Where's the British line? Oh, they're behind that rock over there. No, oh, that's us. Where are they? Right, right. Bottom of the radicals is going to be about halfway up to the top of that tree behind them. Do you see the big bushy right. green tree? Right. Put your radical halfway to the top of it. And fire! Oh, those were close. I'm going to say top of that tree. Bottom of the radical, top of that tree, agents. Bottom of the radical, top of the tree. Hey, hey buddy, can you take a step to the left so you're... Yes, lion Christian. Please get in the lion, lad. There we go. So that will be what a lion right, battle is. I see them all over there. Take aim, top of the radical. No, bottom of the radical, top of that tree behind them. And fire! Oh my I word, we're going to annihilate them if you get a few more shots like that. Nice. So he's using the spyglass to see the shots as they fall. And just keep shooting them. Take aim! Right. Bottom of the radical, top of that tree! Fire! Oh, we got one! Well done, moronic jizzrag! Oh, that was disgusting. What a disgusting name. <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> it was impressive, we, though, to be fair. Can we give that jizzrag a bit of use and use him? Yeah. Fire! Oh, my word! Those were good shots again. Do like the jizzrag and kill another one. All of you. <laughs> no, but I saw so, blood. So long as it's not a coconut. No, exactly. Take Never it. mind. And fire! Oh! No, we didn't oh. hit one. That was one of the other lines. <laughs> Don't worry, lads. We'll get them. Just like if a moronic jizzrag can do it, so can you. I'm gonna, I'm oh, gonna try it myself. Sir, there's British on our left. British on our left. Yeah. Fire! Okay. Step again, gents. Top of the tree. Take aim. Top of the tree. Hello. The, fire. the guy with the flag. I think oh, he improves our accuracy. Flows, yes. Or something. He's he's giving like, it's like a passive bonus Good or something. Work. Same with the guy with um, the drum and the flute. Try harder next time. Take aim. Yeah. Come on then, lads. Show me what you're made of. Fire. Oh. You're not trying anymore, are you? Come on. <laughs> Smoke's in my eyes, sir. There's something oh, in your I'm eyes. Oh. Smoke Take aim. Oh, fuck. I didn't reload. There we go. Ah. Oh. Oh. Adjust eight oh. points. Adjust eight points. Yeah, a little bit higher, gents. Wherever you're aiming now, aim a little bit higher. Because they're all very close. Same again, a little bit higher. Little Come on, gentlemen, give me a little bit of that gusto. Fire! Oh! oh I hit one God, above the hit. tree. I hit one. Good lad! Uh, about like one tenth above the tree. One tenth above the tree. That's one a science. The, the cloud, uh, the, the white cloud behind it. Put your reticule on it. Take aim! I've done it again, haven't I? Hey, fire! Oh! Anyone get one? No, you sure are enjoying yourself back there. How how are you doing for ammo? How many shots have you all got left? 14. 14. 14. Right, right face, we're gonna get a bit closer for these last shots. 
Double time, stay in your two ranks. Move, dude, move. Ah. Okay. So yes, it's also worth noting, well, I'll, I'll talk more when I'm dead. Thank you, Marauder, thank you. But uh, this type of combat isn't that unusual, as in firing many, many shots and uh, not scoring any kills. Um, it took several hundred shots to actually score an effective kill. No, we're not French anymore. We're not French. Bottom of the medical, just above their heads. Back in the day. Bottom of the medical, just above their heads. Aim for the ones in the open. Fire! Oh, well done, zip press. You got one. Once you're reloaded, take aim. Make it quick, dense. As soon as you're reloaded, take aim. Do it quickly. Oh! Doctor! Bottom of the medical, top of their heads. Fire! Run away! Uh, break reload, run away! Run away! Uh, run away. I'm bleeding badly. Oh Christ! The drum the drummer's gone! It's alright, the imposter's dead. Now I don't have that incessant annoying nagging in my ear. It's excellent. This is much better. Nice. Okay, so we have 24 kills, the British have 21. Uh, can you line up on my left? Get your reloads in. Uh, Doc, I need help. Uh, right. well, a Thanks, enemy. Doc. Those are enemies. Right, everyone get your reloads in. We're going to go and support our friendlies off to the right. And then we're going to come back for these lot in a minute. Right, right face, with me. Okay. So effectively, what would happen in a in a battlefield situation, uh, owing to the fact that we're all using smoothbore weapons as opposed to rifle uh, rifled uh, guns, um, the shots would veer off in a semi-random direction when they leave the barrel, because the final sort of touch against the the rim of the barrel would cause an uh, an unexpected spin on the shot, and it wouldn't be like modern rifling, which is where the spin is. Uh, well, the bullet is spinning, uh, rotating as it leaves, so still travelling in a straight direction. The spin would be, say, forward or to the side. Um, and so the shot, you could see it. R rifle, uh, sorry, musketmen would say they would fire, and they could see the shot fly off in the wrong direction. Um, so you couldn't do aimed fire. That, that wasn't really a thing. Aimed fire just wasn't known. Uh, so instead, to compensate, you had to do volley fire. So just fire en masse and kind of hope that some of your shots would land. Now this meant that uh, the accuracy of these weapons was extremely low. Um, I mean, look at the—I've got the numbers just pinned here. Um, it, they did. Uh, I think the Prussians did some field tests um, of their weapons back in the Napoleonic, well, Napoleonic era. They discovered that if you were firing at about 210 meters, uh, which is not that unusual. I mean, most battles would be fought beyond 210 meters. You only had a 5% chance of the shot going on target. Um, and the British did their own tests and found that it was even lower. It was something like under 1% chance of hitting your target. And um, armies would rarely get closer than that sort of region. The musket was really effective within about 100 meters, and that was nigh unheard of, just typically. Check in. And fire. Oh, well done, Deaf Turbo. Got him, see? Another complication. Aiming, sir. Oh, Christ! Dead. Well, we'll never know. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Don't worry about that line behind. They're going to hit a barn door with a banana. Take aim, top of the reticle. Bottom of the reticle, sorry. Midway through Fuck. that smoke. And fire. Right, we're going to go with top of the smoke. Bottom of the reticle, top of that smoke. Okay. Stop blowing our holes in my bloody line. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Majesty. Right, take aim, top Thank of the reticle, top of the smoke. And fire! Oh, well done, Lion One minute, Christian. 17 seconds of the charge. <laughs> Mercy, uh, no, thank you, Shun. Right, gents, take aim, bottom record, top of the smoke again. Uh, a little bit to the right of where that smoke just was, they're coming over the hill. Bottom of the record's gonna be about their head, gents, about their head. Aim for those ones coming over the hill. Fire! Oh, nice. <laughs> Oh. We've got an eight kill lead over them. Beautiful. Gents, same again. Take aim. They're yeah. coming closer. The bottom of the record's going to be about their waist now. They're very close. Waist to knee. Yeah. Take aim. Oh, traverse aim to the left. There's more of them towards the northwest. Traverse aim to the left. You see them just coming out of that tree. By the green bush. Bottom of the record's going to be just above their head. No. And fire. Oh, shit. Turkey. Right face. Right face. All right. Shut your mouth. Please, the back of me. 
Okay. So yes, another thing to consider during this era of warfare is that um, something that this game doesn't represent very well is that the amount of smoke... The amount of smoke that would appear after firing your rifles was just horrendous. After one volley... Gonna charge. Okay. After one volley, you could not see. Oh, After off. sustained fire, you basically you couldn't see the enemy even if they were about 50 meters in front of you. So again, aim fire was impossible. Or uh, rather impractical. Fuck the British! Fuck the British! Fuck you! Someone stab him! Thank you! Mind the flag! Mind the flag! Fuck you! Oh, yeah. Thank you, Diodly. Thank you very much, Diodly. Thank you. Oh, he's fucking deadly with that. Fuck you, Bacon. Oh, it's Bacon Bender. <laughs> ah, suck it, Bacon Bender. One of my Rimworld colonists. I teabag Bacon Bender. One of my back. Oh, Christ, there's loads of them. Fuck, we're not winning this. Fuck. Yeah. Get together, get together! Uh, uh, oh. Did we win? Another one over there, stay with me, stay with me, let's go! Stand still and fight like a man! Stand still and fight like a man! Uh, your shoelace is undone. Look down, your shoelace is undone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got fucking owned there. Holy shit. <laughs> oh no, there's three of them. Thank you, you're welcome. Thank you very much, dude. Oh no! Overconfidence will be your downfall. Oh no! That's hay bales. Thank you, a uh, crazy bird. Thank you, crazy. Thank you. Did we win? <clears throat> I don't know. I guess so. Yeah, that's, that was their doctor. Considering that the rifles were ineffective, did soldiers primarily engage in hand-to-hand -hand combat? S yes and no. Bayonet charges Die were Preußen used, haben den Sieg errungen. Thank you, Shadow. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but the surprising truth, um, obviously there, there are accounts during, say, for example, the Battle of Waterloo, the very famous uh, uh, attack on that farmhouse and courtyard where the British fought hand to hand uh, with the French uh, in the courtyard. And it, it basically resulted in that entire French attack force being wiped out apart from one individual survivor, a drummer boy that the British didn't kill. So the British didn't want to run down like a like a 10 year old boy with a bayonet. So they let him live. Um but uh, yeah, so but hand-to-hand -hand combat. While it wasn't unknown, the truth of the situation here. is that you had a pretty good chance of surviving one of these battles because not a lot of people would die. They'd be in. Yeah, of course, you know, if you got injured, you'd probably die. My point is, battles would commence until one side breaks and then retreats in full. Is this oh, the yeah. stragglers coming in from the back. So effectively, it was a but because the thing is about this type of warfare, it's scary. It's very scary. I don't know if anybody has ever heard a musket fire. Um, it is very loud, very intimidating, and imagine hundreds of them going. The man next to you suddenly has his head caved in by a musket ball. What? You can't just sneak up on me like that. I've got a weak heart. <laughs> Cannonballs are bouncing through lines of men, okay, just causing the most hot, just horrendous injuries. Um, so it wouldn't be a, that long until one side just broke down and fled. Yeah, you can't see anything. The smell is horrible. Just everything is. It, it's extremely intense. This type of combat. It's very, uh, very physically straining as well. So a modern soldier wouldn't go through the level of um, physical stress that uh, an 18th century soldier would, just generally holding and reloading a rifle. Um, 
But effectively, it was very scary, and it really would be a case of which side would flee first, as opposed to which side would wipe out the other. In fact, wiping out the other, almost unheard of. As in, that, that would not happen. It was, it was not a battle to annihilation. It was a battle until one side routes, and the cavalry charges up, chases them off the field, effectively. Indeed, Cabbage Guy, yes, you point out the correct thing there. And that was the case through most of, most of history. Most, it would not normally be, unless we're talking about a siege in which people are surrounded, it would not normally be a fight to the absolute death. It would be a fight to, until whichever side lost their nerve. I need to follow my officer. Just follow the big line, Lul. And it, it's always difficult, I think, watching this type of combat. It's always very... Because we, we've grown up with films and, and you know, we, we've grown up... We, we understand how guns work, don't we? You know, we... Uh, and this, you know, our generation, we, we understand how they work, even if we've never fired a gun. But muskets are very different. Very, very different. It's more like a... It's more like a boomstick that you sort of vaguely fire in a, in a direction and hope you can hit. So it's about getting as many people pointing their boomsticks in one direction and firing simultaneously to scare the enemy. Thank you, Mega Grunt. Thank you very much, Mega Grunt. That's not to undersell the deadliness of the weapon. I'm just saying this is... What you what? No, no, aim that way. Look, on my right. Oh, look, reform. Like the idea away. of sniping right, is not a thing in yeah, this type of warfare. Well. Don't worry about them. Don't worry about them. Our friendlies have got them. We want to aim for that big blob of them. You see them? Follow there. There's going to be halfway up that tree behind them. And fire. Why not use a crossbow or bow and arrow? Walk with me, stay well, in position. the crossbow is a little bit stay different, but the bow and arrow is... A, is the reason why muskets took over for, uh, completely from bows and arrows is a very simple one. And that is that the musket is extremely easy to learn. So easy. Scratch that, he shot me. We're going to deal with these bastards then. Right. Gents, left face. So you can train a group of peasants to use a musket competently ish within a few weeks of Get drills to make a decent archer who will keep firing constantly in battle years the, the archer's entire life like from childhood they would have to start it's expensive halfway in that smoke halfway up the smoke both in time and training wait for them to expose themselves to you and not the perverted dirty kind Hold your fire. Running, what if I want to to That's one run. of the lines. The other one should still be in this position. Wait for them. Wait for them. Have patience, man. Any second now, they're disgusting British Oh, over. Christ! Kill. He was weak. Right, so this aim for that pink bush. Bottom of the reticle. Halfway up the tree behind that pink bush. You see it? Yes, and sir. Fire. Oh, good shots. Those were close. I think what we're going to do is we're going to uh, right face and we're going to deal with this flank that's coming off from the south. That's what we're going okay, to so do. The British have four so, kills. We have two. It. And then once you're reloaded, we'll double time. Okay. So yes, uh, the smoothbore musket, as mentioned, was just incredibly easy to teach uh, to people. Um, very cheap. You had the ability to kill a full armoured man, even a horse, um, with more or less one shot. It easily uh, is, is vastly more useful than a longbow. We've sort of romanticised, I think, the bow and arrow over the years, but at the time, it was just, you'd be, if you went to the field with bows and arrows and your opponent had muskets, you're going to lose. Just They're going to they're gonna wipe you out. Not to mention they'd be able to field units faster and for less expense. Because, you know, what, 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 what happens, you know, like a, a bow hits you, a bow hits you, an arrow hits you, goes in you, causes damage. All well and good. A musket ball hits you, it's going to go right into you, dragging in fabric, fouling from the, from the barrel, dirt, 
your your oh, clothes go in the wound as well. If you have any bones yeah, that are in the way, they get shattered and become fragmentation throughout your body. With me, for goodness sake. The injuries were just, you know, there's no contest. Right, right face. Just kind of shuffle this way. Reform on my left, double right. <laughs> Bo hits you. There's a smoke cloud beyond the pink bush closer to us. Don't aim for the ones across the hill, aim for the pink bush. Bottom of the reticle, top of that pink bush. And fire! Oh, well done, very good. That's two! You jolly nice chap! Again, yeah, people don't realize when you say, like, so a 19mm musket ball, that's song. huge. That. Right, Imagine Jack. getting hit by that. Right, three hundred meters per second. Double time with me, we're gonna get a bit closer. So we can actually hit something. Of course, archery is still lethal. Yeah, absolutely. But there's a reason that um, we don't use bows and arrows anymore. They were immediately outclassed with the presence of firearms. Thank you, Z Fighting Fish. Thank you. Rank on my left. Double rank on my left. Take aim towards the enemy in the defilade here. What the vehicle about their heads? Thank you, fail for life. Thank you, man. Right, thank you, Will. Thank you. While you're reloading, walk either side of me. Take aim. Yeah. Bottom your record's gonna be about their heads, just above their heads. Right. Aim for the ones running away. And fire. Well done, it's a dead. Good lad. Nice. Traverse aim to the right. Aim for those ones in the. Oh shit! Left face. Oh god. Walk into the riverbed. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! The They're lining up on us. Oh Christ! Oh, well done, chaps. Not a single casualty. Right. Oh. Stay along the centre of this riverbed. Come up either side yeah. of me. Stay in the centre of the riverbed. Traverse oh, aim towards that smoke cloud to the southeast. Bottom of the reticle. Top of their smoke. To the top of their heads. Wait. They're going to expose themselves to you very shortly. Yeah, this is round four of five. On my mark. Take aim. Bottom of the reticle. Top of their heads. To the top of their you. smoke. There? And fire. Yeah. Oh, those were bloody close. I could not have done better myself. Or I probably could. So right. it's also worth noting that um, one of the oh, one okay. of the reasons the casualty rates in the American oh, Civil again. War Top of the head, fire. Oh my god, Gaspar was so man. high was that the, the training that you need in order to get a group of musket musket smoothbore muskets firing simultaneously is not as relevant for, for rifled weapons. If you can't see obviously. them, edge forward ever so slightly. You should be able to see them in a second. They're going to come over this hill to take a shot at you. And by the time of the American Civil War, they had breech-loaded rifles. So instead of muzzle-loaded, we had to push the shot down the end. Take five steps forward. Stand on the river bank. Right. They're running away. Top of your uh, bottom of your record. Thank Just you, the ghost. Thank you, ghost. Oh, well done. We got three there. Well done, Moronic Jizrag. Make it a return. So by, okay. by being able to Stay load the right. shots in into the breach... Ah. Oh my God. Oh, Thank you, disaster. Okay, by being able to load the shot into the breach, you can rifle quite effectively with the barrel, the the making it super the accurate. Oh, so American generals during that war would basically march people to their deaths in the face of accurate rifle fire. Form a double rank on my left. Double rank on my left. Bottom of the reticle about their heads. Take your pick. Pick out those targets. Aim for the ones coming towards us. And fire. Hey! Oh, now, well done, Is that Massimo? Oh, one of us got one. No. God. Thank you. Right, get a bit closer comfort. Take aim. Once you're reloaded, oh, you may fire at will. Point blank range. Aim for the ones on the left. Aim for the ones on the left. Oh left. Christ! I shot a bales. I shot a bales. Another one. <laughs> aim for the ones on the right. Fire at will. Point blank range. Fuck! Oh Christ! I shot, shells. I shot the officers. Fuck off, you British cunts! Fire at will. Don't charge. Stay where you are. Yeah. Oh, fuck the British! Right, we'll pick your targets. You uh, oh god! Oh man, oh man, oh man. Left face into the river. Thank Stay you, back. Striggy. Thank you very much, Striggy. Free roam camera, there we go. Right, so yeah, we're definitely leading this with 60 kills. That must have been a last desperate charge uh, by the British there. <clears throat> right. Yeah, the British have little left. 
So you'll notice these guys in green running around. These are like, um, these are the admins being paintball, uh, like paintball referees. So no one shoots them. And they're going around making sure that everyone's obey obeying the rules. So firing lines, not uh, lone wolfing it and shit, that sort of thing. Okay, so it's the three minute mark, so it's now a full bayonet charge, no one can fire. Yeah, we got this in the bag. There's no British left, really. We've caned them this evening. We've utterly, utterly caned the British. This is the fourth round, the fourth proper round. The fifth one's a novelty round. But yes, as I was saying, so yeah, during the American Civil War, um, the generals were following tactics uh, that were now obsolete due to improvements in technology. Specifically, breech-loaded weapons and rifling. Which, while it existed here during the Napoleonic era, it was expensive, difficult, and certainly not uh, fully understood. It was a bit of a bit of an art, really. Uh, now, you know, it's not really science. It was a bit of a sort of... It wasn't as standardized. Thank you, VNMM. Sorry, VNMNNB and Fallline. Thank you, both of you. Thank you kindly. Okay. Where do I get my knowledge from? Uh, I uh, love history. Uh, I took history in college, and uh, I just love history. I'm just a bit of just. If I sit there and read, I read a lot about history. <clears throat> I find it all very fascinating. Thank you, Mr. Lewis, uh, uh, Lewicorn and Capricorn. Thank you very much. Thank you. So this is melee only. So this is the novelty round. In the direction of the enemy, gents. So yes, uh, history, uh, I suppose specializing in, uh, so it would be, uh, so the rise of Bolshevism for one, uh, it's a Russian history, um, quite a bit of Rome, um, a little bit of American history, but not a, not a great deal of American history, history to be fair, but um, mostly Rome to be honest, most of my reading, most of my reading concerns the Roman Empire and the following Byzantine Empire. Right. Here we go. Are we charging immediately? I think that we need to form a line. Okay, we're forming a line. On my go. Ready for your bayonets. In the name of the Koenig. Whoever brings me Haybells' head gets one Deutsche Mark. Uh, <laughs> mark. There you go. <laughs> For the Koenig! Fuck the British! Ah, I threw blood! Suck it! Suck it, Nick Knack! Kill the guy with the Union Jack! Come here, you bastard! Die, Bacon Bender! Oh! Oh! Oh, God! Saranja killed me. Okay. Oops, spectate. How are we doing? Uh, we are getting we are getting beaten actually. I think. Oh, the British might win their first round. Hmm. Uh, no, they really did we win again? Five of five. How much do I know about Rome? All of it, Papa. All of it. Every single, every single minute detail about Rome, I know it all in my brain. No, I don't. <laughs> mm. Okay, I think we won again for the for the fifth round. Nice. Just kill that musician. He's taunting us with his drop. <laughs> There's a drummer just standing alone. Hi, Cake! Hello, Cake. Thank you, Guitar Gun. Thank you very much, Guitar Gun. Thank you. Uh, oh. ba -ba -ba -ba. 
Right, okay, so that was the uh, end of the fifth round. Uh, so now what happens is the various clans will do their recruitment drives for their own groups. <coughs> cool. Well done today, Moronic. Hey, you did very well, sir. You got, a good shot. you got good shots in there. Larry. Thank you for the game, Dinkle. Thank you. Oh, everyone should join the double RCG, by the way. It's the best regiment in the whole pass. Join ZF! Join ZF! Join ZF! Send, send a message to Cyanide on Twitter to join ZF. Thank you, Wubbles. Thank you very much, Wubbles. Thank you. No, 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 now leave me alone, you sonic bastards! Leave me alone! No! Thank you, Darvel. Thank you very much, Darvel. Message Master Leech! Message him to the RCG! Message Stinky Way! Message Stinky Way! No, 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 <laughs> I mean, I'm just a guest here. Try out of that. I didn't organize this. No! Oh, I've got the glasses up my ass again. This happens every week, I swear. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, the pain. Oh, my God. Are you guys bumming him? Oh, God, help me, please. Oh, please, someone end the admin. Please put me out of my misery. Please, <laughs> right, 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 please. Right, sure. Please. Yeah. Thank you, Radiation. Thank you, man. Hey, Dinkle's been killed. Hey! You bummed him to death. Well done. Thank you for thank you for the admining, Ezio. Cool. Right. Um. So I'm gonna back out now. Okay. And let me just see if I can catch them on Teamspeak. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Hi, yeah, sorry, uh, you're very quiet. I think my headset's broken. Apologies. What? Oh, that's what happened. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, sorry, I, I, I can, I, yeah, my headset's definitely broken. Okay. You uh, get a headset. But yeah, th thank you for the game. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. So, did you enjoy yourself tonight? Yes, yes, good fun indeed. Apologies for I the audio that was problems. One. That's all right. It happens. Mm. I think the best round was probably the one before the fun round when we held that river. Yeah. We we kicked the asses. Waves. That was really good. Every round was a victory to the Prussians tonight. Yeah, yeah. As oh, it yeah. always should be. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey, yeah, boy. <laughs> Nine. Kenneth, uh, thank you for the game, Kenneth. No problem. Hope you guys enjoy. Yeah, good indeed. Good indeed. I look forward to yeah. So it's the same time next week. Yeah. Absolutely. Cool. I'm gonna go and try and troubleshoot this headset and figure out why I can't hear you. Okay. Cool. Have a fantastic evening. Thanks again. Are you guys continuing your streams? Yes. Yes. Cool. All right then. Uh, so I'll catch you later and thank you again. Ta ta. Bye bye. Bye. Enjoy bye. Your wank. bye bye. Yes, I will, I will enjoy my wank. Channel switched. Right. There we go. Um, so yeah, for, for some reason, my, my headset, it's sat there incredibly distant. So I reckon my headset's either broken or there's a connection loose or something. I'll have to uh, look into that. Um, but yes, thank you for watching, everybody. So that was uh, that was the regular Thursday, uh, nine o'clock, Hold Fast Nations of War Games. Um, so uh, War Game. Uh, if you want to uh, partake, just uh, join us at nine o'clock. It's public. Uh, feel free to jump right in. Uh, we didn't organize it. I was just invited to tag along. Uh, by Digby, who told me about uh, their existence. Um, but yeah, it's good. Uh, the game is a. Uh, I, I, to be honest, the game is is like a twelve pounder in terms of like you know uh, worth uh, because it doesn't have a huge amount of replay value, and um, it is basically just Mountain Blade. Uh, and uh, most most public games aren't like that, so you've really got to sort of organise one uh, if you're going to have a game with people firing in, in lines and uh, behaving like that. So it's really a Steam deal, twelve pounder type of uh, purchase, really. Um, <clears throat> oh, really? So it's how much on Steam? So it's fourteen pound. Yeah, so about fifteen pounds is probably too much. As in, yeah, go, go probably wait for a Steam deal, wait for a bit off um, on that one, in my opinion. Uh, oh. 
I just fiddled with the wire and something clicked on my headset. Yeah, it's definitely a loose connection. I'll just buy a new headset. Um, so before I go, uh, before I disappear, um, just to give you an update. YouTube-wise, it's the end of the fourth week of... Well, near the end of the fourth week of work on part 10 of 10 uh, of a video essay series about DayZ. Uh, so I'm not doing a bullshittery. I'll do the next bullshittery after this. I'm just trying to, um, uh, to steal some time away for a side project. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to keep cracking on. Um, it's currently 10 o'clock. I will probably keep working until midnight and then go to bed. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to get back on with work, basically. Um, so thank you kindly for watching. Thank you, uh, Just Battle Turtle. Thank you, Just Battle Turtle. Thank you. Can you spoon the dog? If you have cheese, you can do whatever. She'll let you do whatever, really. You okay, sweet pea? Oh, I'll, I'll let her rest. She's tired. Um, so yeah, so thank you again. Uh, have a lovely, lovely evening. Um, right, let me just have a look. <clears throat> so Dinklebean, is he on? Is he going to keep streaming? What's he doing? Uh, I believe he is. Okay, so I'm going to hand you over to Dinklebean, so the officer that you were just seeing there, and uh, you can uh, you can watch him. He's a very, very new streamer. He's only been around for uh, a few weeks, so feel free to give him a warm welcome. Uh, so take care. Have a lovely evening. I'll see you again tomorrow morning. And this is Dinklebean.